welcome to the Cinema 4D Quick Tips. As you might know, the quickest way of adjusting the visibility of objects in the editor or the rendering is by using these traffic lights here. These two dots are the visibility switches. If you click one of these, you can see green will be always visible, red will be invisible, what you can see now. And if you switch it back to gray, this will be default, which will inherit the setting of a parent. Now, if I select this object and use the traffic lights again, you can see that these are directly connected to the visible in editor and visible in renderer parameters. So the top one is for visibility in editor and the bottom one for visibility in renderer. But now let me show you a few tricks here. The first one is if you click and drag one of the states, you can paint the state all across the other objects. And you can also do that with the invisible state and go back to default. You can also just make it visible and then invisible and paint the invisibility directly. And another thing that I like, especially when you work with hierarchies, is, let me unfold this here, is when you hold down the control key, you can set the visibility state for the whole hierarchy down. So all of the children will get the same visibility state. And the last one that I want to show here is actually my favorite shortcut, which is the Alt key. And if you Alt click the traffic lights, you will actually switch both the visible in editor and visible in renderer to another state. And of course, you can also paint this like so. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy our quick tips, please like, comment and subscribe.